Hey everybody, I'm Steven Sitkowski, the founder of Sitkowski Trading Academy. And let me share with you the single biggest question that I get. Has the market finally hit bottom? Or stocks can't go any lower than this, can they? Well, instead of supposing, why don't we just look at facts? So I'm gonna share with you a chart. Let me do that for you right now. And let's dive in. This would be a great exercise for you. Okay, let's look at the SPY. The SPY is an ETF. It is a proxy for the S&P 500. The S&P 500 represents 500 large cap stocks. Basically, this is the stock market. Okay, so we look at this and we go, wow, it's going up, up, up. And then we had this big dip. And man, it can't go any lower than that, right? Wrong. Look at a longer term chart. This is six months. If we go back a year, well, still looks like it can't go any lower. Now we go back three years. What do we see? Three years ago, the market was exactly where it is today. Yeah, but can it go lower? Well, let's go to a five year chart. Look at down here. So right now the SPY is at about $250 a share. Down here, we had this really strong level of support. And let's check this out. We were probably sitting at what, 180? Can this market go lower? Yeah. It could go from 250 to 180. That's a 70 point move. That's another 30%. So I don't want anybody feeling like, wow, this can't go further down. It has been lower. It will go lower at some point in the future, more than likely. Now, is this market going to fall further? Well, let's kind of look at it. All right, here's my question for you. As you start to think about, say, the next 30 days, and we think about the coronavirus and all that that means, and right now we're at, God forbid, about 8,000 deaths in this country. It is forecasted to be between 100 and 200,000. As that news comes in, as unemployment continues to rise, in the last two weeks, we've had 10 million people file for new unemployment benefits. Do you think that number is gonna go up or down over the next 30 days? Is the death count gonna go up or down? Over the next 30 days, do you feel like we're gonna get our, hand, our hands around this virus, be able to quantify risk, or do you think there's gonna be more panic? And all of that says to me, this market absolutely can go lower. Now, might we come up with some mir miracle cure? Yes might somehow one of the medical drug companies figure out how to curtail the virus? Yes, what is the likelihood? Not good. Are they gonna come up with a vaccine? Sure. How long is that gonna take? Probably six months. So here's my point, and I'm not trying to make light of the virus. And I can already hear some people going, wow, you wanna teach us how to make money off of this pandemic. I wanna teach you how to protect yourself from the market. And what I'm doing is reflecting to you the biggest question that I'm getting, which is, have we hit bottom? The answer is maybe, in my estimation, no. I am going to be decidedly bullish over the next 30 days unless I get some new information. So how can we do that? Well, we can buy put options on high-flying stocks. That's number one. But here's a way that maybe you haven't thought of. Let me show you what is called an inverse leveraged ETF. So what do you notice about this? This particular ETF went from 37 up to 115. When what was happening? Well, let's go back and look at the market when the market was falling. So this is an ETF that goes up when the stock market goes down. Now I'm not here to give investment advice and I'm not recommending that you all run out and buy this. I know nothing about you, but I want you to understand there are ways to profit when the market goes down. And oh, by the way, that TZA has options on it. 
when you had heard the news, wow, we got this outbreak in China and they're starting to close down cities and the virus is starting to spread. Let me ask you a question. Was it much of a reach to go, wow, this is gonna have a negative impact on the stock market? No. So you could have jumped in and bought call options on this and those options would be worth a fortune today. By the way, this goes to illustrate so much is common sense. When we realize, oh, uh, people aren't going to be allowed to or want to fly anymore. Gee, I wonder what's gonna to happen to the price of airline stocks. Boom. We watched uh, United go from 90 down to 22. Is that a big shock? Or we heard about the spread of the virus on cruise ships and Carnival went from 51, by the way, had a double top up here, went from 51, now it's down to what, 850? Does that shock you? One of the things I always tell people, you know more than you think you do. Just be an observer. And then you need to understand enough to be able to turn that into a strategy. You need to know how to make money when stocks go up and when stocks go down. And by the way, if you're tired of being in the dark and you understand that there are opportunities out there, but you don't know how to capitalize them, well, here's the good news. I'm actually going to be doing a two-day class uh, that's going to be April 10th and April 11th. If that is something that you might be interested in, then I'm going to suggest that um, you go to my website, Sidkowski Trading Academy, and enroll in that class. Again, it's two days, full immersion, awesome stuff. We're going to cover fundamental analysis, technical analysis, uh, how to be able to evaluate a company, how to read a chart, how to find entry position, exit positions, um, how to be able to use ETFs. We'll go into some various option strategies, um, how to be able to just buy a call or a put, how to put two options uh, together, how to be able to hedge your position. I mean, it's just really, really good stuff. You know, and I know there are people out there that in times like this with lots of volatility who are making a fortune. If you're not one of them, it would probably make sense to go through this class. So again, if you go to Sikowski Trading Academy, and then you can here, I'll just, let me show you the page. I'll share this screen with you. Here in a second. Hang tight. Uh, share screen, there we go. Okay. So this is what it looks like. And if you go over to enroll now, or if you go to products, it'll tell you what we have to offer. By the way, if you like the software tool, um, you can subscribe to that as well. Those that come to class get the software for the next um, 30 days for free. So anyway, I think the days of being an educator, the days of giving your money to somebody else and turning a blind eye, the days of picking a stock and hoping it goes up and writing your losers down too far. If you've just lost, you know, 30, 35% in the market and you're trying to figure out what's the best way to make it back, I'm going to suggest the key to that is training and education. So if you go to Sikowski Trading Academy, I limit my classes to 30. I know we've got a few slots still left for that. Um, I'm doing another presentation for a private group on Wednesday. So if you want to do this, try to get in uh, before Wednesday, but in any event. Okay. Enough of all that. Can the market go lower? Yes. Do I expect it to go lower? Yes. Can I promise you it will go lower? No. It's all going to be dependent upon the news. But I think the news is going to be more negative than positive and really wanted to address that issue. But again, the key is get yourself educated, gang. That's what it is all about. Okay. Thanks for being with me. As usual, it's so cool to watch my subscriber list grow organically. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, be sure and be one. 
click on the notification bell so that you get informed every time that I put out a new video. So look, stay safe. God bless you. God keep his arms around your family. Remember, we're all in this together and uh, I'll be talking to you soon. Hopefully I'll see you in class uh, next week. Bye for now. Thank you.